Right now, they're number one in the league in several departments, including batting average at 271. They're up there in wins, runs, and batting average first. Home runs second to Milwaukee, who's at 116. But then they catch the ball as well. They've made 36 errors this year, and the Padres have made 34, the only team with fewer errors than Cincinnati. And here's Byron Kerr with more on these hard-hitting, good-fielding Cincinnati. Reds. Well, Bob, it's no secret you're talking about the pitching in Miami. They certainly did a great job, but also pitching coach Steve McCaddy says it's going to be tough to try to sustain it against this number one Cincinnati Reds offense. They're tough. You're in a tough ballpark, and but you still you can't vary from just what your plan is, is keep the ball down and make your pitches. If you make good pitches, you're going to get people out. If you don't get them out, basically it's just going to be a weak base hit the other way. But you just got to stay with it. You can't worry about how many we score doesn't make any difference at all. Just do your job and limit them to as few as you can give them. Joey Votto, the all-star for the Reds. Brooke Jacoby, the batting coach, told me he's capable of a triple crown, Rob. He's that kind of player. Yes, he is, and he walks an awful lot. He's got uh, 57 walks, 74 punch outs, uh, and he hits in front of Scott Rowland and does a great job also at first base. But the bottom line with Votto is uh, he has battled anxiety problems off the field, and he is a great player on the field.